What's up troopers, my name is Neon and we have something very interesting we need to be talking about. So you know the whole situation where the assault rifles get in this insane spread? Well there's going to be a lot of interesting stuff but it's going to be changing very soon. So before we get into the video make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and of course leave a like, thank you very much. So troopers we all know how the spread is with the ARs, it can be pretty wild. Problem is it's actually inconsistent, it's not even doing it correctly. So basically what it was supposed to be was is after half of your magazine the spread would increase by 15 to 20 20 percent what i was trying to do was was encourage you to burst fire so you'll stop shooting and it'll basically reset and then you can start shooting again pretty much to be more consistent and i definitely see what they're trying to do and i can definitely get it like even my playstyle is actually becoming more that burst type of playstyle just like how it was in the older battlefields i don't know how i feel about that though i don't really mind it when it keeps spray of prey but i also don't mind it in this way as well i feel like that's maybe why a lot of people are kind of mad with the new map because they feel like how you play with the game now is a lot more tricky and more harder as an infantry player and then maybe it could be like more of a skill level thing now i don't know but it has definitely been a lot more tricky when it comes to assault rifles and because of this and because it hasn't been working they have actually been addressing it and they've been addressing one weapon as well what is also going to be tweaked so in here they were just saying as a part of the future update they want to target on the feedback with the burst fire and with the assault rifles They're obviously saying with everything right now with the delay it's just not working correctly with the spread and they're trying to resolve that and so what they're basically doing is with the spread they're actually reducing it by half this is absolutely huge because right now i feel like when you're having close gun fights i feel like the spread is already wild especially when it's far distance i totally get it shouldn't be killing people across the map with it but sometimes i felt like having close gun fights just wasn't consistent enough so reducing it down to half i feel like the assault rifles have more value but because of this change they have said that they're going to tweak some of the assault rifles to kind of fit with this category because i guess they wasn't really planning to actually have the spread reduced down to half so because of this change i guess they're going to be tweaking with some of the weapons i really hope they don't tweak too much with the acwr because that gun is really good right now i remember when it was probably one of the worst assault rifles in the game and now it's probably one of the best please don't touch that gun all right it's really nice so that is just an absolutely wild change and i'm looking forward to see how it happens as i talked about this whole weapon change before i was excited but i was also nervous because i was really worried it was going to screw it up and unfortunately they kind of did they screwed it up but then they also fixed it at the same time the next thing we need to talk about is the rm 6a right now this gun is actually the best gun in the game it is absolutely amazing even with all this change of the weapon spread the rm 6a is absolutely brutal i already made a setup video for you troopers i already double uploaded today so i already made an rm 6a setup video for you guys so you can go and check that out if you want to because right now the gun is still absolutely brutal and it's really good but the crazy thing is they are actually gonna nerf it here we go they're finally gonna do it after all this time waiting it literally a whole season of this gun being absolutely insane and they're finally gonna nerf it so what they are doing with the rm 6a is they are actually gonna reduce the four bullet hit to kill range by 10 meters for the standard and the high powered ammunition also removing the cqb ammo and they're also reducing the bullet velocity down by 90 so that actually is a pretty big change when it comes to the rm 6a but lucky enough right now the gun hasn't been nerfed so go and use it while it's still overpowered but i think we all knew and i think we're all glad that it's finally gonna happen because i swear to god every time i look at the kill log it's all i see is the rm 6a rm 6a rm 6a and it's just been absolutely brutal i think we're all finally glad it's gonna get nerfed but yeah that is some of the pretty big changes when it comes to assault rifles so we just gotta look forward to that next update and see what they do anyway troopers thank you very much for listening to me talk if you did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe be a part of Pink Gugami. I'll see you troopers on the battlefield.